Hello and welcome to ShowMeAcademy.com. In this tutorial, we're going to show you how to print pages in Microsoft Internet Explorer with the background colors and images included. Now, let me illustrate for you an example of what can happen sometimes when you go to print something on a page. I'm going to go to a site here, ask.com. And you notice here when we pull this up, there's a nice gray background with a, a gradual shading going to the white. There's the Ask logo here. There's a blue box around the search. There's a number of just different images and graphics here that are designed to give the page a nice look and feel. So maybe I send this to my printer and I decide that I want to uh, show this to others. Uh, maybe I want to use it as a template for another design or what have you. But when I go to send it to my printer, the item that comes up looks very different. I'm going to use the print preview here to, get, uh, to give you a feel for that. It's a little hard to see because the screen here is small, but you can see that when I go to the print preview, the page that it's about to print looks nothing like what we saw when we went to ask.com. Ask.com had that nice gray area around the outside. There was a blue area around the search box. Heck, the whole ask logo doesn't even show up here. Well, why is it that that happens? Well, quite simply, you could put all of the graphics that you see on a web page and all the colors into two big buckets, if you will. There are those that are set as the background and those that are included in the content of the page as the foreground. And that, that which is included in the foreground will be printed when you print. And by default, Internet Explorer chooses not to print those items that are in the background. They do this primarily for readability concerns because if you have background images or background colors that are behind your text, it may be very hard to read that text when you print the document out. However, in certain cases, you might decide that I really want all of this to be printed out exactly as it's shown on screen. So you need a way to be able to do that. We'll show you how. So again, you see here how ugly the ask.com page looks when I go to print. So I'm going to close this out. And then I'm going to go to Tools, Internet Options. And from here, I'm going to click on the Advanced tab. And once you get to the Advanced tab, under the settings area there's this whole host of checkboxes and you're going to scroll down to a section for printing and you'll see there's only a single checkbox that you can either check or uncheck under printing and it says print background colors and images so I'm going to check that and I'm going to click OK and now to illustrate the change that makes uh, for printing purposes I'm going to use the print preview option so I click here and I go to print preview. And now that you can see right in front of you that what's about to be sent to the printer is a much more accurate representation of what I actually saw on the screen. Because all of this gray, all of this blue, even the ask logo itself was set on the page as a background. And therefore, it, they will only show on the printer if we check this option that we showed you under the tools menu. That concludes this tutorial and thank you for using showmeacademy.com.